Well, 74 years ago, during World War II, the U.S. was forced to surrender the Bataan Peninsula. The surrendered troops were then forced to make a grueling 65-mile death march to prison camps. Many of those soldiers were from the Brainerd Lakes area. The Brainerd community honored their sacrifices at the Fall of Bataan 74th Anniversary Wreath Lang Ceremony. Logan Gay has more. Every year on April 9th, the Brainerd community comes together to honor the fallen soldiers from Brainerd's A Company 194th Tank Battalion. Those who survived the death march after the fall of the Bataan Peninsula were then forced to spend years living in poor conditions in prison camps. There was no ability to get them any reinforcement and resupply, and after four months of bitter fighting, they were forced to surrender on the Bataan Peninsula and subsequently endured what's become known as the Bataan Death March and, and three and a half years in Japanese POW camps. With a rifle salute, plus a reading of all the fallen soldiers' names and a presentation of their dog tags, the National Guard soldiers were able to give those fallen soldiers a hero send-off. Dog tags that we were placing on the barrel of the, uh, the weapon of the M3 Stewart tank out there. For the, each of the Bataan area survived, uh, Bataan veterans who was lost either in battle in the Philippines or on the Bataan death march or who subsequently died in one of the Japanese POW camps. The last surviving member of Brainerd's A Company 194th Tank Battalion recalls some of the tragic moments he encountered during that time. We were all buddies, you know. And it was a lot harder to see those guys die than it would be a stranger. And during the ceremony, they took the time to honor missing in action soldier Julius Knudsen, who is originally from Brainerd, but has yet to make it home. We don't know where his remains are, but he always has a place with us. He's in the hearts of every soldier in this battalion. And as long as there's a 1st Battalion, 194th Tank Regiment, we'll know where his spirit is. Everyone who attended the ceremony stressed the importance of remembering the sacrifices of those brave men. In Brainerd, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. In August, the annual Bataan Memorial March will take place at the Brainerd National Guard Armory. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.